In Panama, Malaysia, a young man, Tan Chan Ha, could not walk properly since he was young. Fortunately, he came into contact with Siji. Tima helped him undergo corrective surgery at a hospital. Now that he's gradually recovering, he has volunteered to give back. Finally, he's able to cross the doorstep of his house. For Ten Chen Hao, this is a big present after turning 23. I hope I can stop using crutches by the beginning of next year. I want to learn to drive, and then I can drive my mother to go out to eat and shop. Then I will find a job so I can take care of my mother. <laughs> When Ten Chen Hao was little, he took medications for five years due to platelet abnormalities. The overdose in medication damaged his leg nerves, and therefore he could not walk since he was five years old. By the end of 2017, city volunteers referred Ten Chen Hao to a hospital in Kuala Lumpur to undergo corrective surgery. Using a screw to straighten a bent bone, it is very painful. I could not bear the pain, so I fainted. Despite the pain, I did not think of giving up. To help Ten recover faster, Tima arranged a physical therapist to go to his house and help him undergo rehabilitation. His muscles have started to wither, so we need to put in efforts to strengthen his muscles. For more than two years, the volunteers have continuously provided care and companionship. Every time we come, we see his progress. I'm very happy. In fact, I still want him to work even harder because the doctor said the golden recovery period is very short. After all, he seldom comes into contact with outside world. Besides helping him to exercise, we will chat with him and tell him about what is happening in society so he can get in touch with the society. Ten, who has gradually recovered, started to volunteer and serve others. I hope he can help other people. He can see that there are different problems people face in society. This is a good opportunity to get in contact with the outside world. I hope he can learn to walk soon and find a job. Fortunately, Ten Chen Hao's family have met the volunteers and Tima members who have brought hope to this family in need.